in my opinion, Fina, the winner of the last Big Brother Niger, you know, season, is one of the most intelligent housemates to come out of the house. This is a reality. We've seen this young lady with her very you no know, down to earth attitude and streetwise nature do a lot of big things. We're talking about a few months after leaving the Big Brother Niger house. This young lady is really you know, setting herself up in solid social media circles and she's getting you know noticed on all the social media platforms and it's really amazing to see that you know regardless of all the issues that have been trending of all over nigeria talking about the political scene and all fina still has a short place on the entertainment scene very recently she has been bagging a lot of endorsement deals and this young lady is really doing well for herself i must tell you her humble nature is really paying off you've seen this young lady try to flow with all her housemates ex-housemates and it's just really cool i must say fina is a very down-to-earth person and she's just cool man and i really must one thing i really like about her is her street nature her streetwise nature and this young lady also encourages her fans to be very respectful to ex-housemates and um, it's very touching we know a lot of housemates that love to toxic fans and all they always go behind the scene to say oh we are not toxic but we know these people are really toxic now very recently we saw fina on a podcast on the glitch podcast the glitch africa podcast hosted by susan padrock and it was really amazing to see that this young lady is not just you know humble she's also very brilliant she said a lot of interesting things you know about women supporting women the entertainment scene life at the big brother after the big brother niger house and i must tell you this young lady is really in touch with reality this girl is ready to take africa by storm with her humble nature i don't know how she did it but everybody just kind of loves her they come around she doesn't have air she's not you know she's one over 100 million naira and she's up there with a lot of endorsements it's expected that she know she changed her circle of friends you know as her status has really been upgraded but that is not the case with fina fina is still doing very well to stay level-headed and i must say it's really amazing now on the interview fina was all out there you know dishing out facts dishing out points strong points and like i always say you know it's a man's word forgive me for saying that but that's a reality so we expect that women in africa get to support themselves and that's what you know fina was pushing for fina definitely understands what it is to be in the cement industry that is dominated by men and you know it's ladies don't really support the way they should i'm talking about the already established ladies now here is a clip of a short clip of what liam fina said on the female YouTube. pick up a female the men the men mamas them that we know that we have they are not doing it as it can also be fear yeah, yeah that's so true you know we, we ladies we have wahala yeah you can go and help somebody now exactly. pray, 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 go drag you. one very striking thing about fina's interview is how well she mixes her english with pigeon <laughs> this young lady is so original we don't get to see much of this from housemates everybody's trying to speak big english and this is not me calling or spiting them out spiting them this is just me being like very real fina is so real like she was saying that you know she doesn't see a lot of the big mamas like she called them you know support each other and all and it's very heartbreaking but on the other hand she understands that people that help that get help sometimes you know turn around to backstab such people that help them but Immediately this clip got published or came out to the public. Fina's sorry, um Beauty's fans came very strongly for Fina. Now the main accusation was the fact that just a few days after Beauty was disqualified, that Fina was already with Beauty's man. Talking about Beauty's man in the house. I don't even want to mention his name because he shouldn't be part of this discussion. But for community guidelines, I'm sorry, I may not be able to put out some of those comments, those very rash comments that you know beauty's fans put out there it was, it was very embarrassing all in all of them we are pointing to the same facts and some of them even chipped in the fact that she couldn't speak english like make one full line of <laughs> full sentence of english and i'm like what in the world is all of this like this thing has happened already everybody should just move on besides a full man a full grown man cannot be pushed or forced to stay to, with someone he doesn't want i don't know if you guys get what i'm saying so i found this very disturbing that you know beauty's fans would come out there to want to remember all of this and i'm like don't these guys even forgive and even more even if there's this is not a case of case of wanting to forgive life has happened everybody's got has made their decision the guy chose to be with fina and put the thing fina won the show so it's 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 very embarrassing to see that these guys are still wanting to be very petty about this by the way it's important that we don't forget what fina said there it's she opened the eyes of a lot of people and i'm sure those that 
the the particular statement was you know directed that they know themselves those in the entertainment industry that don't support ladies the way they're supposed to they all know themselves and it's a point of correction and little wonder we see fina wanting to do stuff with her fellow housemates who she's definitely bigger than yes this is not me trying to like raise confusion or or or, 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 or you know argument here and there but when you're big you're big and there's nothing that can anyone can do about it so fam do you really think that you know beauty's fans we are in the right by calling finna out and accusing her of snatching beauty's man and all of that or is it just being you know borderline petty and unnecessary making unnecessary comments on the internet this is biggest baby entertainment and i don't want to know what you guys think about this until our next clip god bless and peace out stay peaceful